Hey guys, you already know who it is. It is Cage Moon here, and today I just want to tell you guys a story about what happened today in Spanish class. Like, my Spanish teacher is probably um, my worst teacher I've ever had before. So, I walk into class. Um, she says this every single class, but we always, like, don't follow it because, I mean, it makes no sense. She says... You guys drop your pencil. You, you can't sharpen your pencil. You're not. If you drop your pencil, you get an F for the day. Or if you drop your paper, you get an F for the day. She's she's legit crazy. But um, basically, what happened is she said all that stuff, and somebody um dropped their pencil as a joke and um tried to pick it up. Except this time, a Spanish teacher actually got really mad. She, like, started yelling at them, and I'm like, oh, shoot. That would really suck if it happens to me. So, I actually, seven minutes later, I think, my pencil broke, and I hate that sound, so it made me flinch, and I, like, dropped my pencil. I don't know if you guys don't like that sound either, but I, I hate that sound. Um, like, when there's, like, no lead, and you just, like, try to write on the paper. Yeah, it was that sound. I don't know if you guys know about that, but whatever. Um, so... And then, um, she said all that stuff, and, like, I cracked it, and I started writing, so I flinched and dropped it, and then I raised my hand for about, like, she never answers any questions, even though she looks right at you, she just doesn't call on you, like, I'll, my hands was in the air for literally, like, three minutes until she actually called on me. She's like, Maddie, what do you want? And I'm like, um, I dropped my pencil, can I pick it up? And then she's like, okay, attention for you, go call your mom. So, pick up the phone in front of the whole class, so the whole class is silent, because you know how that is if you go to public schools. I don't know if you're homeschooled, but if you go to public schools, everybody just stops and silent and listens to you. So, I'm like, well, maybe I, I should just call her out on that. Like, makes no sense. Why get detention for that? So, I am on the phone. I don't dial my mom's number because I was literally, seriously, if you're that, if you're actually going to go to detention for dropping a pencil, then, I mean, you're weird. I wasn't going to go to detention, no. So, basically, um, I was on the phone. I was like, hey, mom, even though nobody was there, I was like, hey, mom, she's, and, um, I'm like, I have detention, and I waited, like, a couple seconds, and then I'm like, yeah, well, my Spanish teacher said at the start of the class that if we, like, drop our pencil or anything, any of that stuff, we would need detention and stuff, so I dropped my pencil, and I asked her if I could pick it up, and she said no, and she gave me detention, and so my class got started like they were like oh oh he's a savage he's a savage and they started like with their pencils they started going like that on the table and it was like so funny i started like blushing because i didn't think they were gonna do that and stuff so and then my spanish teacher's like no 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 let me see the phone and i got nervous because nobody was actually on the line and i'm like hello hello and i'm like she hung up and i dropped the phone and then she sent me outside for the rest of class but luckily my language arts teachers are the best. Seriously, like, they're the best. So, they understood. Well, Miss Brown wasn't here today, but Miss Wolf, she's so nice. So, um, she understood, like, when I was talking to her, she just said to, like, sit outside, like, for the rest of it. Like, I told her the whole story, and she was just really cool about it. So, I mean, I just thought I would bring you this story, because what kind of teacher? I don't know if you guys had any mean teachers. Put that down in the comments. But if you get in, but what teacher literally makes it so if you drop your pencil you get detention no nobody does that except for that teacher so i hate my spanish teacher nobody else in that class likes her um so basically that happened i was supposed to go to detention but that makes no sense why would i go to detention why would i do that i think i can even like tell the principal and he would be like oh yeah it doesn't even matter because our principal is so cool um, he's probably one of the coolest principals out there. Um, I'm not gonna say his name because I don't know if he does, if he wants me to. But, 
yeah, so that all happened, and it really kind of sucks, but, I mean, you gotta live with it, but I just wanted to bring you guys this really weird story, like, if you guys have ever had a teacher like that, please, please put it in the comments. So, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, you guys. But first, say bye to Dante, yes. Aww. Okay, bye, you guys. Peace.